Hey everyone, it's Basic Sorgonomics, Mike Sorg at Sorgatron on the Twitter with you today. And uh, today I want to talk a little bit about goal setting. I, I know, it's not real techy or anything like that. I know, what is this show becoming? We're talking about um, a little bit of... Uh, of, uh, of, of, of getting things done yesterday, of course, uh, with the Remember the Milk and everything. I'm just loving it. I forgot how amazing it was when you pay for the thing. And uh, today I got a lot done, actually a lot with it, and really kind of going through that to-do list and everything. Um, but, uh, you know, a lot of conversation about the uh, things happening you know, with, the, with the business, with other businesses, talking to other entrepreneurs. And, um, and I go back to, um, this is a concept uh, that really, uh, actually was really from, uh, uh, back to work, we're in the man kind of thing uh, from a few years ago. And, uh, and, and, and it's been reiterated through several things I've read, listened to, and, and a little bit some of our podcasts have uh, talked about. And I want to kind of kind of put, put you in a mindset because um, a lot of times when people want to, uh, you know, they have a big task in front of them, whether they want to start a business, whether they want to buy a house, whether they want to, to you know, take on a house project or something like that. Um, I think people uh, definitely look at the giant task in front of them. And then that is a stopping point, you know, and, uh, and, and I think, um, uh, you know, and that's a problem. And, and, and unfortunately, you know, because you're busy, because you have so much to do. Um, that, uh, you know, and, and then that thing that never gets done, um, go back to, uh, stuff that I've written, stuff that we talked about here about, uh, uh, one day is, is killer. One day is poison. One day I'm going to get to that thing, you know, cause it's a big thing and I know I'm not going to get to it today, but you didn't do the first step so that thing's not going to get done. Um, or even, you know, having the, uh, you know, the discussion today was about, uh, uh, starting up a business and having the idea and the goal, I have a very strong goal, something that I do need to work on a little bit. Um, and then figuring out, okay, and then what are the first things I can do now and how do we fill in the gaps? Um, and and just kind of going through little things um, throughout, you don't need to make a big stride tomorrow, right? You need to make a baby step today that'll get you to that big stride. And it'll seem like a big stride after you've been taking the baby steps every day. And then soon you'll be running, right? Um a friend that was starting at the time a magazine, this is some 10 years ago, actually, he was starting a magazine, doing some music work, uh, production, uh, you know, things of that nature. And he, he, he had a really good philosophy that I kind of take uh, in the back of my head. Not so much these days, because uh, at the time, you know, I had the day job, I wanted to grow this thing over here. And his thing was, um, as long as I take an hour a day to work on that thing, I'm good. You know, I'm, I'm making progress. As long as I've taken that hour to work on that project that I want to grow into a business, that I want to grow into something great, whatever that case may be, you know, um, if it's, uh, man, I got to clean the house, you know, just spend, you know, an hour a day or an hour a week, not an hour a week, you know, or just a small say, okay, we're going to take care of one thing today. Okay, we're going to take care of one thing tomorrow. Uh, you know, uh, you know, building your business, building your website, building whatever that thing is you want to do. Identify the First thing you need to do, you know, um, you know, okay, I want to make a website. It's going to have a community like, great. What's the website about? Okay. Scale that back. You know, all right, we're going to, we're going to make the website to make a community community. That's X. Okay. Let's scale it back a little bit now. Okay. We need the website. Where are we going to do to make the website? Okay. We're going to scale back. Um, what, what, where are we going to put the website? How are we going to build the website? Can I build the website? Do I need to hire somebody? Scale back a little bit. Uh, what's the name of the website? You know, what is the little thing that you can start with today on that? And then next, then go with the next little thing you can take the next step tomorrow. Little, little, little things. And that's what today was for me. Again, I talked about remember the milk and going through my to-do list because there's a lot of initiatives that we're working on around here. A lot of those little things. And some of them just seem to be waning but then I get to sit down and go through that chick off those task lists, you know, go into something like that, some kind of to-do list and have a specific list on there with that goal is basically the headline, make awesomeswebsite.com and then sit there and go through what is every step you need to go through that you know of. This is the first time making a website. It was the first time doing a business this is the first time doing making your cake. Um, you don't know all the steps necessarily to get there, right? This is your big task, right? And uh, put the ones you know. And as you go, say, okay, we started 
We started working on the website. Oh, I forgot I need a .com. That's a thing that needs to happen. Oh, I need to figure out uh, what a heck an RSS feed is. We've got to do some reading on that. There's another to-do item in there. Yes, your list is going to grow, but you're going to start ticking a few of those things off going towards that goal. Um, and I think that's uh, you know one of the ways that you can kind of start making a little bit of motion towards whatever it is you're, you're trying to do. And again, that's something that we've done here on very um, small basis, right? Um, and there's also making sure that first step is put forward, right? Putting it on paper or digitally on paper. Um, there is something to be said, and it depends on how you work too. Um, there was, I think back to work last week, they were talking about uh, use of notebooks, right? And for them, putting it on paper makes a lot of sense. Right, putting it on paper makes it real, and and I believe in that too. Um, a lot of times, uh, when you're taking notes in school, I remember um, it wasn't about the fact that it was in paper and you could go back to it. The fact that you wrote it down, committed it to your memory, to your memory banks, whatever the case may be. Um, writing down the this is my task list commits you to it. There it is in front of you. Now you have to do it right. Um, now, uh, yeah, you could you could just stop there, put it in a notebook, put it on a shelf, and you're done. Sure, you still need to execute. It's not just about the idea, you know. But um, but that's uh, yeah, that hopefully gets you started with something like that. Um, something like this, you know. Not, you know, I I, I <laughs> the goal of this morning thing is kind of diverted. Originally, was I want a morning show. Right. Uh, I've always wanted that kind of thing uh, to, to happen that, you know, maybe we tune in something live and people can tune into. And that's what this show started with was something like that. Now, yeah, we've diverted. The task list turned into something else with a different headline goal. You know, I'd love to have an opportunity to do that again. But this started as a motivational thing that says, hey, good morning. This is what's on my mind. Now it's turned into something else that that uh, is motivated to, again, kind of get out what's on my mind and share those kinds of ideas that go along with uh, the company line, which is the line that's in my head um, about how we are to go about things. Our manifesto, if if you will. And maybe one day I'll talk about the manifesto as well. There was a very wise woman that talked about uh, the a manifesto at a Refresh Pittsburgh uh, so far gone. It's been sitting in my mailbox, and I need to take the next step of that. And uh, maybe that will be an episode of this as well. So let me know what you think. Um, you know, if you have a concept that you're actually trying to figure out what that first step is, and that is just a looming in front of you and you need some help with, let me know. Hit me up on the comments here, wherever you may find this, on the YouTube or on sorgatron.com, or and we'll have a discussion about it. Or email me uh, uh, through mikesorg at, uh, at gmail.com or through the contact page at sorgatronmedia.com or on Twitter at sorgatron. I'd love to help you out, have a conversation about it, and uh, and, and help you kind of along with some things like that. Uh, let me know what you think. Stay tuned. The next uh, educational series, we decided to take a break over the holiday and uh, we're going to be doing instant content with our our friend Katie Dutters. Katie Dudas. I had Katie Dutters on the Twitter. Um, so we're going to have a lot of fun with that. Stay tuned for details at Sorgatron.com. Sign up for the newsletter. And uh, we'll see you guys next time. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at Sorgatronmedia.com.